Shading devices can play an important role in improving the energy efficiency of buildings. You can assess the impact of adding shading devices and fine-tune their placement using solar studies in the Revit application. You can also quickly evaluate the impact of applying different levels of shading on the predicted energy performance of your building using Insight. Let's start by opening one of the Revit models that we'll use for this analysis. Reopen the Classroom No Shades Revit model. Open the default 3D view and zoom in on the building. Next, let's enable the sun path in shadow to see the effect of the sun on our facades. Click the shadow icon at the bottom of the Revit display area to turn on the shadows for this building. Click the sun path icon at the bottom of the Revit display area to open the sun path menu, then select sun path on to enable the sun path. Now let's access and change the sun path settings. Click the sun path icon to open the sun path menu, then select sun settings. Select a still solar study and choose the Summer Solstice 3 p.m. preset for this location. Click OK to apply these settings. Return to the default 3D view and note the amount of sun that is directly shining on the glazing of the south facade of the building and generating cooling loads. Next, let's generate insights for this unshaded model. If needed, go to the Analyze tab and click Generate. Now we're ready to open another project model which has shading elements included on the facades. Download and open the Classroom with Shades Revit model. Open the default 3D view and zoom in on the building. Display the same sun and shadow information using the same still solar study preset. In the pop-up menu, select the option to use the specified project location, date, and time instead to display the appropriate sun path. Choose Summer Solstice 3 p.m. for this location. Now return to the default 3D view and note how the shading elements block much of the sun from hitting the glazing on the south facade, thereby reducing the cooling loads. Let's also generate insights for this shaded model and access the results. First, open the Analyze tab and click Generate to send this model to the cloud and generate insights. After the analysis is completed, we can click Optimize to access the results. Now we'll create a new insight to compare the unshaded and shaded versions of this model. Start by clicking Back to Insight, then click Insights. Now select Create Insight to create a new insight containing just these two models. Select the shaded and unshaded models to be compared and click Done. Click the Action button, the three dots to the right side of the tile, and choose Rename from the pop-up menu to change the name of this insight. Set the name of this insight to Shading Devices Comparison. Open the insight by selecting this tile. Now we can apply our baseline scenario to each of these models in the Insight and compare the results. In the Model Comparison dashboard, select Baseline from the Scenarios drop-down menu to apply the same assumptions to all the energy models in this Insight. When the updates are complete, hover over the bars to display the energy performance for each of the versions of the model included in this Insight.